you ever test the old egg drop routine in high school? You're talking about like on the on the spoon when you're doing this, the egg races? Talking about this. Oh. That's actually a good one right there. Good. So the whole point of the egg drop is to teach how shock propagates through something and how to suppress it. What would you use if you were gonna go other than You know that? what I would do? I would do this. I would do what everybody has. This is like everybody has a cell phone. Little kids have cell phones now. We can use all of the same science and engineering attributes that you use for the egg drop, but apply it to the cell phone. Let's kick it up not only a notch, but like 10 notches. Let's do it to where we can take it in water. Let's do it to where we can throw it off the building. And let's do it to where we can shoot it. If we build our outer casing out of a hard plastic, surround the phone with a shock absorbent gel, and find a material to seal our case, our cell phone should be able to make a call after getting wet, being dropped, and even shot. All right, All right. let's build it. This polycarbonate, when you shoot it, is just gonna leave a little tiny nub on the back. It will protect the phone. This foam will be surrounded all the way around by the ballistics gel. This gel dampens the shock wave before it reaches the cell phone. And that's what this is all about. If that's it. We have this neoprene that is going to go in between the pieces, and that's going to make it waterproof. All right, we're here at the dock, and we're going to test to see if our case is waterproof by putting my cell phone in it and throwing it in the water. OK, ready, buddy? Here we go. Go ahead. One, two, three. Oh, dude, I'm so, look at that. That's fine. That is so fine, it's not even funny. I think the neoprene worked really well. I don't see any seepage. There's only one way to test this, man. Give me a phone call. Call Grant. Oh, ho, ho, ho. there you have it. Dr. Kevin Schmo. What do you say, kind sir? Not much. It's, it's uh, working pretty well. Can you hear me? I can totally hear you, man. That's good. So the first test worked. Two more to go now. All right, here we go. Test number two. <laughs> Kev, you ready, buddy? Yeah. Three, two, one. So the ballistics gel absorbed a large amount of the shock wave that went through when it hit the ground. All right, it took the six story drop, but now we gotta see if it's gonna make a phone call. Let's see if it works. Call Grant. Come on. Ha ha! Thing works. It's pretty amazing. Now it's time for the final test. We're gonna shoot it with a nine millimeter bullet. <laughs> nice hit. Whew, that was good. Good impact, too. Ooh, you know what I see in there? I see a little bit of shatter. I see a little bit of shatter. You know what it did? It went through the first one, yeah. through the phone, blew out the backside, and then the backside kind of captured it. Look at that. Blew out the back. Oh, look at the backside yeah. of that. Oh, yeah. Dude, that was my cell phone. Hold on, let me try something. Call Grant. No, no. Yeah, not going to happen. Overall, it's a failure, but hey, I think we did a good job. I do I'm too. proud of us. I am too, man. Well done. Hey, and good shot, bro.